and welcome. Uh, today I just want to talk to you about a uh, recording session I did not too long ago and uh, kind of give a shout out to my friends at Encore Music in Nacogdoches, Texas. Uh, that's where the session took place and, and maybe give you some insight on how that whole uh, uh, project went and some of the things maybe that you could do or be aware of when you go to do a, a recording session. Anyhow, uh, we've got some pictures that we're going to upload and show you the studio and uh, and the engineer and and our. Hopefully, you'll check out their website. Uh, their website is www.encore.com, and that's in Nacogdoches, Texas. And uh, Dana Woods is the owner, great guy, and they they have a full line of musical instruments. Plus, got a great studio, and I had a had a good time there so uh, you can look at the pictures and uh, hope you'll enjoy that uh, one of the things I want to talk to you about obviously is uh, if you're doing a session and I've done quite a few is and it may sound silly but you want to make sure you set up the time negotiate the price that you're willing to go do the session for also uh, make sure you're there on time uh, in this session, I did two two projects at, at one time. There, we had a couple of different artists that wanted to record, and uh, one of the interesting things to me was that the client was actually in the control booth with the engineer, uh, basically going phrase by phrase through the songs, wanting specific sounds, uh, specific licks, even the register in which I was playing on my guitar. So it come down on one of them to basically doing a Don Helms type uh, non-pedal type sound. He wanted kind of like the old Hank Williams, like the uh, real haunting kind of a ghost kind of a sound. The other session was pretty much straightforward uh, country gospel and uh, had a lot of minors in it and had to play over the minors. So that's something that, you know, gives a lot of guys problems that we'll be going over more in depth in our some of our lessons. But anyhow, uh, like I said, when you go to do a session, make sure you can handle it. Because like I said, they really had some pretty interesting chord charts. And it was all number system. So brush up on your number system and be prepared. Like I said, uh, they wanted specific sounds. They were critiquing, you know, phrase by phrase. So it becomes pretty laborious, you know, uh, on some of the deals. But I had a good time and uh, got to uh, reconnect with Dana. I hadn't got to see him in a while. And we talked music and family and friends and some of the guys we used to know in the past. And again, uh, just a shout out to him and what he's got going on there at Nacogdoches. Great guy. If you need anything, any musical products, instruments, any recording, uh, he'd be a great guy to get a hold of there. And again, uh, the link is www.encore.com. And it's in Nacogdoches. So uh, I'll probably go through some lessons later on and we'll... Uh, go through some of the charts or variations of the charts like I did at this session. So again, uh, thank you for watching and this is Aaron and uh, thank you for subscribing. All right, appreciate it.